So today we're trying to diagnose what the problem is with this 17 inch iMac G5. So all we've done now is you just plugged it in over there and we'll turn it on and see what it does. And we have a yellow light, some sounds and the famous chime. Let's see what happens. It's making some noises. For some reason the disk drive's going on it. And nothing other than the sound. It's worrying away, you can maybe hear the fan. But we have nothing on our screen. So what I'm gonna do is we give it give it another chance. So we've powered it off again and now let's turn it back on. With the light on the front again, chime. <laughs> this drive's going again, and I don't think it's doing anything. So let's turn it off and open it up. So to open up an iMac G5, we just simply put it on its face. Maybe I should be using the towel. Or something to cover it but we just turn one i think that's the third one and there's the other one it's over two to three screws we turn and then we can lift off the back so now we've undone the screws we can just simply lift the back off like so that's how it comes off it's really simple this back especially compared to modern computers and here you are this is the guts of the imac g5 probably shouldn't put my hand on that bit but yeah, this is, these are the guts. Let's have a look. So as you can see here, this is the back. And I think I've already found the problem with it. Up here, just in this bit here, you're going to see two capacitors. We'll zoom in and see if we can get you to see them. As you can see there, those two capacitors have unfortunately like bulged or at least whatever you want to call it. Them two are actually dead. See some of the others down here, they are still good. Nothing else looks to be a bit, nothing else looks to be problematic in this PC. Except just a bit of dust and grime with wear. But there is one thing we can do to try and boot some life into this PC. I want to click on it a PC, it's a Mac, I was probably still a computer, but either way. We have two little buttons here, just here. I can't remember which one, it's called something, it's called something like the PCM. But I'm just going to press both of them because we can. And then we're going to stick it back on power and see what it does. But other than that, it looks like these do need to be replaced. That's probably the reason why this isn't working. So let's stick the back back on. So we've plugged the power cable back in and obviously put it back together. Let's see what happens now we've pressed all those buttons. We have our yellow light. We have our chime. Is anything going to happen? And you can see that the screen has actually come on a bit. And we can very faintly see the Apple logo. But it's definitely something to do with those capacitors or something to do with the power system. More likely those capacitors. But that's it. We've diagnosed the problem, I guess. We'll probably try and fix this in a future video. But until then, I'll see you next time.